Hello everybody, it's the Turbo Greek here. I haven't made a video in a really long time, but I finally decided to get off my ass and start making videos again. Uh, probably not going to be as much gameplay because the whole gameplay thing started to really bore me, and that's kind of why I stopped making videos. Like, it's really a pain to keep uploading lots of things at once. I think f short things like this, like top tens, would be kind of better. I don't know, tell me what you guys think. Anyway, this is my top ten favorite Dynasty Warriors characters. Now, Dynasty Warriors is a game made by Koei, where you're some Asian general, and you run around, and you stab people. You can choose between a whole shitload of different characters. I don't know. It's a good game. You guys should check it out. You probably don't know what the fuck it is. But here's my top ten favorite characters. Alright, let's go. Number ten. Shahu Doom. Shahu Doom is 29 years old, 6 foot 2, and he's been in every single Dynasty Warriors game to date. The model shown here is Dynasty Warriors 3. He's got a big ass sword and an eye patch. Now, in Chinese folklore, it was said that at the Battle of Xia Pi, he got shot in the eye and he ate his own eye. Now that is extremely hardcore, and that's why he's number 10. Number 9, Liu Bei. Liu Bei's first appearance as a playable character was in Dynasty Warriors 2. Now, the model shown here is of Dynasty Warriors 4, and the weapon that he normally uses is a steel longsword. He is the founder and emperor of the Shu Dynasty, and every single person that he meets he pretty much inspires, which is pretty cool. Like, he's not as badass as these other characters that I have on this list, but he knows how to inspire people, or inspire badass people, to join his ranks. Number 8, Lu Meng. Lu Meng took over as lead strategist for Wu after Zhou Yu had died. He's been in every single Dynasty Warriors game since Dynasty Warriors 2, and he's also the mentor of Lu Jun and Gan Ning. Also, he's got a badass halberd axe thingamajigger, and he's pretty hardcore. The model shown here is Dynasty Warriors 3. Number 7 is Zhou Tai. Zhou Tai is a former pirate and the sworn protector of Sun Quan, the commander of Wu. Now, his weapon of choice is a katana, and he's got some pretty badass armor, too. That's why he's number seven. Number six, Gan Ning. Like Zhou Tai, he's a former pirate that converted to Wu. He's been in every single game since Dynasty Warriors 2. He carries a giant-ass sword, and he wears bells around his waist to warn enemies of their impending doom. Now that is pretty fucking cool. Number five, Tai Chi Si. Tai Chi Si used to be a part of Louis Young's forces before he converted to Sun Tse's forces during the campaign on the Wu territory. He carries dual spiral rods and has been in every Dynasty Warriors game to date. Now, those dual spiral rods fuck shit up. And they're probably fucking the strongest weapon in the game besides Wu Bu's halberd. Number 4, Ling Tong. Ling Tong uses nunchucks as a Wu general and has been in every single Dynasty Warriors game since Dynasty Warriors 5. I would put him at number 1 because he's technically my favorite character, but Koei fucked up his character model in Dynasty Warriors 7. Does he look like a bitch? What? <laughs> Does he look like a bitch? No! Then why you try to fuck him like a bitch? Number three, Sun Se. Sun Se has been in every Dynasty Warriors game since Dynasty Warriors 3. He's the son of Sun Jian, the rightful heir to the Wu throne. Also, he whacks bitches with his giant tonfus. Number two, Ma Chao. Ma Chao has been in every Dynasty Warriors game since Dynasty Warriors 2. He's known as the Dragon Warrior, and he despises Cao Cao because Cao Cao killed his father, his brother, and two of his sisters. He stands for justice and is also an unbelievably great horseman. He would be my favorite character, but for this list, I'm going to go with the most badass OP person in the entire game. Number one, Lu Bu. Now, I know people are saying, well, why would you have Lu Bu in here? He may be OP, but he's not the coolest character out there. Well, to those people I say, 
What other character harvests fucking anal virginities with his giant ass halberd like a boss? He's like the Grim Reaper of fucking Chinese words. He's like the Chinese Chuck Norris for fuck's sake. He's like, I don't even know how to describe him. He's just amazing. He's fucking cool. He's awesome. He's got cool fucking dangly hair thing of the bobbers. And this model's from Dynasty Warriors 3. By the way, practically all of these models were from Dynasty Warriors 3. The, that reason being is because Dynasty Warriors 3 is the best fucking Dynasty Warriors game out there. It's better than 7, it's better than 6, it's better than any goddamn Dynasty Warriors game out there. Because Koei got it right that time, and Koei seriously has to get their shit straight. Because Dynasty, like, if they do like a Dynasty Warriors 3 HD, like they did fucking Resident Evil HD, I'd buy it for like 150 bucks, no joke. Because this game was fucking sick. Don't forget to rate this shit and subscribe. Makes me feel as cool and Greek as him. Should, uh... Probably start rating and subscribing. Just looking at you kind of funny. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee